Okay, we're at Fort Nagley. This was the only stone fort, I think, built during the Civil War here in Nashville by the Union Army when they took over Nashville. We're up on top of a hill, and I'll show you that in a minute, but this is the visitor center, which is pretty neat looking. It's a quiet day here. It's a beautiful day, though. Beautiful weather. Now let me go walk in, and I'll show you the visitor center here of Fort Nagley. This is the visitor center. Have a little shop right there with some things you could get. They even have t-shirts. And then on this side, they have some storyboards. They got books for sale. Posters. They do have a few artifacts here in this one case. There's an old canteen. There's a shell. And then there's a few artifacts over here they found. Right over here. And then on this side, they have a storyboard of Fort Nagley and the Civil War in Nashville. I didn't know that Andrew Johnson was appointed by Lincoln as the military governor in Johnson. March of 1862. Andrew Johnson. <laughs> Andrew Jackson and then Johnson so that's interesting so about a month after the fort was built he became the military governor of Nashville yes the future vice president and future president of the United States good to know alright we'll show you some outside there's also a movie inside we're gonna watch let's go walk outside Ruby's here. They let Ruby in. Here's the entrance of the fort. This fort is actually owned by the city of Nashville. They saved it. It was in disrepair. Look at this. Check this out. And they were going to tear it down. The city of Nashville bought it. And the uh, fixed it up they used the CCC during the depression to rebuild the fort here's some more storyboards right here there's a granite tablet here that's etched out you can't see too well in a video and we're up on a hill and want to climb up here to the top of the fort there's a big american flag here too check that out huh. all right we'll go up here and we'll talk a little about how this fort was built okay here's a better view of the arch from what i read the bottom part was is part of the original arch and the top part of this arch was built by the ccc during the depression when they did a rebuild and restore restoration of this fort so I want to walk up here looks like they have this closed off right now so it looks like you used to be able to drive up here but you can't do it now and okay and over here is a visitor center we just came from all right let's show you some more Okay, we started walking up the hill to the top of the fort. There's some fortifications over here. There's a storyboard. This storyboard talks about the surrender of Nashville in February of 1862 to General Buell. There was not a shot fired because most of the Confederates ran away. They left town. And the people that were supporting the South left. So there was a great panic here. People like ran away as the Federals were coming in. So there was no battle here. They just came in and took over the state capital, Nashville. 
and held it from February of 1862 until the end of the war. Of course, the Battle of Nashville was here. This was not part of the battle, but the men from this fort fought in the battle. The battle was actually fought south of here. So if I turn, you can't see, but 17 miles away from here is, I think, Franklin. And then south of Franklin is Spring Hill. And those were the two battles that initially started it. And then they had the Battle of Nashville uh, just in these suburbs. There's um, Shy, Shy Hill over that way. And then there's another hill over there, I think it's called Overton, over there, and the line of defense was across that area for the Battle of Nashville. But we're not there, we're at the fort. So let me show you some more as we go up the hill. Okay, we're at the lower level here of the fort. They have storyboards, but almost unreadable. All I can read on there says Bastions. And then over here, you can see as I walk more to fortification. This is all built by the blacks. They um, recruited free and slave blacks to build the fort for the Union Army. And then looking this way, you can see the skyline of Nashville. See, we're just south of downtown, this hill called St. Cloud Hill. So it's a, got a good view of everywhere. Again, that storyboard, you can't read it. It's kind of beat up. Here's the other side of the fort looking toward downtown, which I would say this is looking north. That storyboard is somewhat readable. They got benches here. So this is the lower part of the fort and I'm gonna go up to the upper part here. Ruby's here. Ruby likes it. She smells animals. Hi hey, Rubes. Oh there's a butterfly. There's a monarch. So it's pretty much in disrepair still. I mean look at the rock. They tell you don't get near the rock walls. They're kind of falling apart. But I guess they're working on them. See they're reclaiming it. This is newer area they fixed up. So I'm gonna go up to the top of the hill here and see what we see, hang on. Okay, we're at the very top of Fort Nagley. We came from right down there. There's downtown. Here's another storyboard, which again is unreadable. All I could read is the inner works and archeology. span Looks like there was a stockade that was here. They tell you to stay away from the stone wall. They're trying to protect it. Let's walk over here. We'll see what we see. You're seeing it when I'm seeing it. Ruby's seeing it too. They let Ruby in the movie to see the movie about the fort. They had a nice movie. Here's some more of the walls right there. Fort Nagley, Nashville up on St. Cloud Hill. Let's see what we see up here. Wow, what a view. Here's another storyboard. It says here, the Battle of Nashville. Oh, that talks about the Battle of Nashville. Barely readable. Peach Orchard Hill. This was during the Battle of Nashville. So we're looking down toward Franklin that way. Then as I turn, you're gonna be looking toward downtown. See, that away. I think the river is over there. I'm not sure. But this is Fort Nagley and Nashville. The largest stone fort built by the Union Army during the Civil War. Interesting story about Nashville. How they used it. The Union Army used this town as a base for supplies. 
They had warehouses here to supply the battles. The Union Army. Oh, let's walk up this one here, too. We'll walk together and see what this says. Looks like there's another storyboard here. Again, almost unreadable. It says Fort Design. So how they designed it. They designed it after European design. Here's a look this way. You can see the fortifications here. The ruins, basically. And I'm going to go pan around this way. And there's some ruins right over there. Here's some more of the fort here. And that's again looking back up north toward the downtown. Okay. Ruby likes it. We'll show you some more. Okay, we walked around a whole hill. We're on our way back. And look what I found. They have sheep here. The Nashville Choo Choo Crew. Dot com. They have sheep here that eat the weeds around the fort. They're not here right now. They say this fence is electrified, so don't touch it. Here's part of the fort there that's kind of falling apart, that limestone. That's a nice park right in the middle of Nashville. We're right in the middle of town here. Not much parking. A little bit over there, and then there's a parking lot over to the other side of the visitor center. Not many people here, but that's all right. It's a weekday in the fall. It's a little cool today. We're in the 50s. They had a cool spell. Should be around 70. Here's some more of the fort there. They got it all blocked off because it's falling apart. It needs some work. Oh, that's the original limestone. Yeah. Yeah, I would think so. See that? Yeah. There's it up the hill. It's up on a big hill. There's some more of it right there. They're trying to preserve it the best they can. The city. They need some help. They need to redo all the signs. The signs are barely readable. Some are not readable. We need some help from the uh, Battlefield Trust. Where's Gary? There's some kind of a stone here, but I can't read it. I don't know what it says, if it said anything. Oh, there's something on there, but I can't read it. It says Nagley. Oh, I see. Barely could read it. E-G-L-E-Y. All right. So this is Fort Nagley in Nashville. And that's about it. See ya. Okay. This is bonus. I didn't notice. I walked back into the visitor center and I found out they have a new plan here. Phase one. They're going to make this into a beautiful park. Look at this. This used to be a baseball field. They're going to fix it all up into a park. There's the fort up here is going to be. There's going to be a new visitor center over there. Walking paths. Look at that. They need some money though. We got to get the federal guard. Where's Joe Biden and who's the other people in charge they need some money donate some money to the city of nashville will you for this all right we had a nice lady here tell me the whole story what's your name oh i'm natalie bell hi natalie hello there what a nice story you told me well so fort nagley is one of the premier sites historic sites civil war sites in the middle of nashville tennessee you got it all right, thank you.